Welcome to the Loner Ranger Radio Show. My name is Bruce Woodburn, and I am the Loner Ranger. Welcome to my show. It's such a beautiful day to be out looking at property. And on this show, we're going to talk about how to save money when buying or selling real estate. What type of mortgage might be the best for you? What's going on in the market right now? So I don't ever want you guys to ever get anything from me other than the real news, not the fake news. This is not an advertisement show. This is an information show. And when you you may already own a home and you may think, well, I don't really need much information when it comes to what's going on in the market. You absolutely do because your biggest investment is sitting right underneath your feet right now. Today, you're out mowing your investment you are doing laundry in your investment, you are cleaning up the investment, all of these things pertain to you. And if you don't have the investment and you are currently renting, then pay close attention to the show because this is absolutely a call to action today. And I'm going to tell you something, as we start to see prices increase consistently. I mean, we saw 20% last year, 20% the year before, 17.5% increase the year before. Anybody that bought a home in the last three to five years made so much money, you probably made as much money as you earn in many, many cases. So don't sit on the sidelines of life letting the rest of us get rich in real estate when you are continuing to rent. Now, what's another reason to stop renting? I mean, we all know that buying a home, you're going to make money based on the equity that you build in the home. And the nice thing about it is you're not taxed on that income because it's what's called unrealized gains. And until you sell it and you have some type of capital gain, and that capital gain is only when you exceed a certain uh, 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 capital gain threshold, I think it's 600 and something thousand dollars. If you are a CPA and you're listening to my show right now, you can call me and inform me as to exactly what that number is, but I think it's in the $600,000 gain. So other than that, I don't believe you're going to be subject to any capital gains from a primary residence. However, let's get back on track for this because housing is continuing to go up, but rents are are predicted to go up by another 20% this year. So if you are currently renting and you really enjoy being a a tenant and helping people like me and other listeners to this show make money in real estate, we'll continue in that direction. If that is not what you want to do and you want to break the cycle, then call me at 407-706-3313. That's 407-706-3313. 3313. So rents are going up, houses are going up, and interest rates are going up. All right, there's the real news. No fake news here, guys. All right, don't let any of these advertisements tell you that it's different because it's not. It's just a trick. And I'm seeing a lot of lenders out there that you guys are shopping and comparing with. And that's smart. You should always do your homework when it comes to buying a, a car or a house or getting a mortgage, or any big ticket item, it's important that you do your homework. I'm applying for the job. I am a direct lender. I'm in all 50 states. I've been lending for 33 years come March 19th. I grew up here. My family's from here. I know the market, and I'm committed to making sure that you, my client, always gets the best possible information so you can make informed decisions when it comes to purchasing a home. Now, Interest rates are rising. We knew they would. I mean, we've been talking about that for months. And let me tell you something. I'm not really that concerned about it. I know a lot of folks may be. You might think, you know what? It's getting out of reach for me. Well, you know what? It is going to get out of reach for you. And it's going to get out of reacher for you. So don't wait any longer. Let me tell you some really cool stuff. Okay, we, we already got this out of the way. Interest rates are going up. I'm already seeing interest rates in the fours. That's right. You heard me. You can still get a 15 year in the twos. If your credit is really good, you still may may be able to get a loan in the threes. But for a lot of you that have average credit, you're in the high threes and even fours right now. Investment property is well into the fours and, and, and approaching the 5%. Now, is that reason to go, you know what? I'm going to hold back. No, it's not. And here's why it's not. Yes, your payment may be a little bit higher with a higher interest rate, but you're going to continue to gain equity and equity builds wealth. And that's what it's all about. 
Don't step over a dollar to pick up a penny. It's not worth it. Don't say I'm going to stay out of the game and not buy real estate because interest rates are going up and houses are going up. You want housing prices to go up. You just don't want them to go up if you're renting. You don't want them to go up if you're getting ready to buy. But as soon as you close, you're the one that wants them to go up. So, and it's really funny. That's just the the thing that I deal with in this market. Everybody wants, everybody complains about the housing going up and it's out of reach. You made the most money you could ever have possibly made on the sale of your home, but you don't want to pay that same price when it comes to buying your new one. Listen, that's just normal. We all feel that way. We want to get a deal and then we want to sell at a profit. It's normal. However, stay in the game. Get in the game right now. So I got some news I was just reading that came out with some statistics of the best places to live in the top cities in North America. Now listen to this, you guys. Tampa, number one in the country. Number one in the country, Tampa. Jacksonville, number two. Then you got Raleigh, San Antonio, Charlotte, Nashville, Atlanta. I can't believe Atlanta's on there, but it is. Phoenix, Orlando, number nine, and Austin, number, Austin, Texas, number 10. So out of the top 10, three of them are in Florida, and two of them are the top places to live. So look it. I lend throughout the state of Florida. I also lend in all 50 states. So if you need help and you want to buy in one of these uh Uh, in one of these markets outside of central Florida, feel free to give me a call. I can be reached at 407-706-3313 or go to my website at webringyouhome.com. That's webringyouhome.com. Now, if Tampa and and Jacksonville and Orlando are on the top 10 list, does that tell you you should be in the market? 100% do not sit on the sidelines and let this one slip through the cracks. Become a homeowner. I'm committed because you've heard me talking about this every week now since December that in 2022, I made it my commitment that I want to help the most first time home buyers that I've ever helped in any single year. Now, what I can't tell you is what that number is off the top of my head. I don't know what it is, but I can tell you what my goal is, and that's 50 a month, 600 a year. That's a lot of first-time home buyers. That doesn't include you that need to refinance. That doesn't include you that are selling a house to buy another one. That doesn't include my big jumbos. That doesn't include my construction perm or my renovation loans. All that is over and above my goal to help the first-time home buyer. Why am I so committed to help the first-time home buyer when, quite frankly, it's a little bit more work to do a first-time home buyer? Let's just be honest with you. Generally, have a little bit more credit issues, don't have as much cash because people that are coming to me that have a bunch of money to put down on a house, where do you think they got it from? It wasn't their 401k. It was from the sale of another house. So first-time home buyers generally struggle with cash to close, payments, and credit isn't generally as high as what we would consider a move up buyer to be. Now, don't call me up and complain and say, that's not true. I have an 800 credit score and I'm a first time home buyer. Great. There is some of you out there. There's no question about it. And some of you may be able to put down more than three and a half, five or 10 or even 20% to put down as a first time home buyer, but it's not typical. So, Since it's not typical, let me speak to all of those that might struggle to come up with the cash. Credit's not perfect. And when I say perfect, over 760 is is an excellent score. Okay, 740, a good score. 720, an average score. Under 700 is going to be... uh, between average and below average. We used to not think of that. You used to think I got a 690 credit score. That's great. It's not even average anymore. So if you are at the 600 point, you are, you're way below average when it comes to that. And listen, this is not a judgment call on you. Okay. It's not a judgment call because the great news for you is I don't have credit score requirements on some of my loan products. Some of them I do, some of them I don't. But for my first time home buyer products, I got some amazing stuff with only three and a half percent down FHA loans, and you don't have to have perfect credit scores. Matter of fact, my son, one of my loan officers that def, that loves working with first time home buyers, closed a client at a 511 credit score. Now they had to put down a hoop of money to get it, but they got turned down by five banks. I did it. 
The loan arranger closed the transaction. And when I say the loan arranger did it, I did it really with the help of my team because they're amazing and they fight for you. If you want somebody that's going to fight for you and help you, then hire me. All you got to do is stop everything you're doing right now, pick up your phone and plug my phone number into your phone. It's my phone number. It's not a toll free number. It's not an 800 number. It's my, it's my phone number. And it comes to me. 407-706-3313. I'm the Lone Arranger. Don't miss out on this opportunity. Let's get into a few more things that are going on right now that I think are super uh, impactful and I want you to know about them. Because for many of you, you know that I have special programs to assist different segments of the market. When I mean different segments of the market, educators, teachers, law enforcement, first responders, healthcare workers. I have a special program designed to help you. And if you're buying a home, I will connect you with a real estate agent that has been vetted through my home buyer program and will contribute toward your closing costs. You also get discounts towards closing costs. When you fall into that category, one of you in the household is a teacher, educator, first responder, police officer, sheriff, work for the sheriff department, work for the police department. You have to be able to show evidence of that and you get some substantial discounts. In addition to me connecting you with a real estate agent that's going to fight for closing costs from the seller for you too. So you're interested in that? Let me help you with that. I am going to be, and and by the way, I am the official official, uh, sponsor and preferred lender uh, for the... um, Uh, Florida Education Association, which is a teacher's union, and I am speaking on behalf of Cross Country Mortgage and assisting educators and leadership in the Northeast Winter Leadership Conference on February 18th and 19th in Jacksonville. So if you are an educator and you plan on attending that, make sure you stop by and say hi to me. Uh, Other things that are going on in uh, the industry right now. I have a few available uh, tickets to my movie night. So you know that I sponsor a movie night. It's for my existing clients, my loyal clients, the people that care about me and I am in a relationship with. I invite and I do a free movie night and I am uh, going to be um, previewing um, Uncharted, but with Mark Wahlberg and Tom Holland on February the 22nd. That's going to be in Okoe at the um, West Orange uh, Cinema. So if you're interested in uh, a couple of tickets to come see me on that, call me at 407-706-3313 or text me at that number as well. Now, if you're interested in me helping you become a homeowner or getting a new home or upgrading or helping a family member or refinancing, go to my website at webringyouhome.com. That's webringyouhome.com. So few things, those are a few big things that we got going on right now. Uh, I also do have a, um, a, uh, a workshop that we're going to be doing for, um, Uh, it's going to be a real estate mastermind workshop. You don't have to be a real estate agent. If you want to know how the experts are buying, selling real estate, how to get in the market, amass wealth, become a homeowner, and um, learn how to buy multiple properties with as little down as possible, then you don't want to miss this class. Now, I'm going to come back from the next break, and I'll tell you what date that is because in my head – Um, I've got a date, but I want to make sure that I've got the right date to give to you. But it is this month, and um, uh, I will be teaching it alongside Cleve Loveland uh, from Loveland Properties, whom, which you know I uh, host and a co-host on his show and my show on Saturday's same station at noon. So stay tuned, and I'll give you the dates of that event. Uh, I'll be back in five minutes with more of the Lone Arranger radio show. We're going to talk about what prices are doing, what the average price is, what interest rates are doing, and how you can get in the market. We'll be back in five minutes. We're the Lone Arranger radio show with Bruce Woodburn, Cross Country Mortgage, 407-706-3313, or we bring you home dot com bring you home dot com stay tuned 
Welcome back to the Lone Ranger Radio Show. My name is Bruce Woodburn, and I'm the Lone Ranger. It's such a beautiful Sunday, and I'm so glad that you're tuning into my uh, show. I'm hoping that you find that this gives you a lot of valuable information because this is not a sales pitch for me and my company. Granted, I'm in the business of doing mortgages, and I'd love to earn your business, but I want you to know that this is a show, and this is uh, 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 this is about how to be able to master the art of owning real estate, how you can get the most out of it. How, what What is the best type of loans for you? What's going on in the market right now? So let's get right down to it. I promised you before I went on the last break that I was going to share with you when my next class is going to be, and it is Real Estate Mastery, and it's going to be a Zoom class. You must go to webringyouhome.com. That's webringyouhome.com and register for Real Estate Mastery 6 p.m. on February the 24th. Now, listen, folks, this is a this is going to be a down and dirty class. This is not uh, for you to buy my CDs, my eight track tapes, or uh, buy a booklet and follow through a program with me. This is me teaching you what I have done. This is me sharing with you mistakes I have made. This is me sharing with you successes. This is me sharing with you some strategies on how to buy the most real estate with the least amount of money. That's what this is about. This is about how to become a homeowner if you're not one already. How to invest in multiple properties if you're already a homeowner. So we're going to cover all that. We got about an hour and 15 minutes to do it. It's going to be all in guys. This means pay sharp attention. Now here's what I'm going to ask you. I only open it up to a hundred people. That's it. 100 people on a zoom call. I can't take more than that. And it bogs my system down. So if this is not something that you're taking seriously, leave the space open for somebody that is, if you know somebody that wants to become a real estate investor, and I'm not talking about a flipper, I'm talking about gaining wealth in real estate. Or if you're not even a homeowner yet, this is a, this is a must attend class. That's going to be, uh, we bring you home.com pre-register, go to my calendars. You'll see real estate mastery zoom on February the 24th. So, uh, you'll want to register for that right away. All right. Uh, we mentioned in the last segment out of the top 10 c- cities in North America for growth in real estate and great places to live. Tampa comes in number one. Jacksonville comes in number two and Orlando comes in number nine. Pretty impressive three cities out of 10 right here in your backyard. You tell me that investing in real estate isn't the right thing to do. It's incredible. And you're just going to continue to grow and make wealth. It's going to happen, man. Don't hesitate, even though interest rates are going up. So what are interest rates doing? Well, we lost some ground again this week in the bond market. We had a couple of decent days, but they weren't big days. They just were kind of flat. So when the bond market deteriorates, interest rates go up. When the Fed threatens to raise interest rates, even though they haven't raised them yet, they've already gone up. Quite frankly, I wish the Fed would just raise the interest rate, rip the Band-Aid off, and let us settle down. Because when the Fed threatens to do something and then doesn't follow through with it, it creates uncertainty in the market. And uncertainty is definitely something that Wall Street will hedge up when it comes to um, protection from the uncertainty. And that's really where we have been left at this particular point is a lot of uncertainty. I'm going to be, uh, I'm going to be back in five minutes to talk a little bit more about some current trends in the market and how you can get into this market and master the art of owning real estate, managing properties, saving money when it comes to getting a mortgage and really leveraging that so that you can retire as not only a millionaire, but a multimillionaire. And I'll show you how to do it. And I don't charge you one dime. I just share experiences with you. These are not things that I did in 1972. These are things that I do today. We'll be back in five minutes with more of the Lone Ranger Radio Show with Bruce Woodburn, Cross Country Mortgage, 407-706-3313. That's 407-706-3313. Or webringyouhome.com. Webringyouhome.com. Stay tuned. I'll be back in five. 
Welcome back to the Lone Ranger Radio Show. My name is Bruce Woodburn, and I'm the Lone Ranger. Thank you so much for tuning into my show today. Hope that you're finding it uh, to be informative, and we're going to get right down to some business here so that we can keep you up to speed on exactly what's going on in the market right now. So, a couple things I wanted to mention was my class that I will be teaching called Real Estate Mastery. It will be a Zoom class on February the 24th at 6 p.m. You must go to webringyouhome.com. That's webringyouhome.com. And uh, you will learn everything you need to know about how to buy real estate, how to sell real estate, how to accumulate wealth in real estate. This is not a sales class. This is not on you coming to, uh, to me for a mortgage. Of course, that's what I want you to do at the end of the day because I do mortgages. But this is a class on how to educate you on what I did, the mistakes I made, the successes I had when it came to buying and selling real estate. I didn't have a lot of money. So I had to figure out a way to be able to accumulate wealth in real estate. Um, And I did that and I figured it out how to do it the easiest possible way with not having with having the minimal amount of money to work with. So if you're interested in that, there will be 100 seats available at a maximum. (coughs) Excuse me. Don't register for my class if you're not going to pay attention and you're not going to follow through with the whole program. I need the seats available for people that are. Remember, I'm committed to helping the most first-time home buyers in 2022 that I've ever helped in my career. I am seeking to help 50 new people that are not homeowners presently get into the market, 50 people per month. That is 600 new families that I want to help. They are the ones that need the help the most. You guys that have great credit, money in the bank, you're selling a house, making a hundred grand on it. You, you, you're easy for me to help. But the tougher ones are the first time home buyers that don't have a lot of cash to work with, may not have excellent credit, uh, and uh, maybe struggling to be able to afford a new home based on the prices that uh, we're experiencing in the market. So we saw a 20% increase in the market in Central Florida last year. We're expecting about the same this year, but things are starting to slow down when it comes to housing. Why? Because interest rates are going up and houses are continuing to go up, but incomes are not following suit on that. Okay, so yes, we're experiencing hyperinflation. You can thank your uh, your wonderful president for super hyperinflation, and he's denying that it even exists. Well, that's not my that's that that's not my uh, uh, position to judge. I can just tell you that's what I'm experiencing when I go to buy bacon, eggs, milk, gasoline, all those things. And when my president is denying that there's even an inflation issue, then that becomes problematic for you and I. Those are the things that are causing your income to be less than it was last year. That's not good. That's not good, but it is reality. Now, this too shall change. So how do you supplement that income? You make sure you're buying real estate. Real estate's where to go. So out of the top 10 cities to buy in America, we had three in the top 10. Number one, Tampa. Number two, Jacksonville. Number nine, Orlando. There is no reason for you not to get in this market. You will make money in real estate. If you are a real estate agent and you're listening to my show out there, stop sending your transactions to these idiots that tell you that your client's approved and then ask you for an extension the day before closing. These people don't know what they're doing. My team is experts. You know why? I trained them myself. I made it a point that if I was going to be in the mortgage business, I was going to be the best lender in the world. That was my goal. Now, whether I am or not, it remains to be seen. But I can tell you this much. I make it a point to make sure that I'm giving you value and that I know the information. And if I don't know the answer, I'm going to sure as heck find out what it is. You want a great lender? You call me. I'll take great care of you. Not only are my terms great, but the service is over the top. Why? Because I like over the top service when I go to buy something. And I think you deserve the same. 407-706-3313. That's 407-706-3313. If you know somebody that's renting right now, get them over to me right away. Get them in my class. They must register at webringyouhome.com for my 6 p.m. Zoom class on February uh, 24th. If you are an educator and you're going to be going to the Northeast Winter Leadership Conference in Jacksonville, 
I will be speaking there as well. I'd love to have you. I do have special programs that offer substantial discounts to educators, first responders, police officers, and um, uh, healthcare workers. So ask me about my home product. It's called Home, Home Ownership Made Easy. You know, the federal government and the state don't have any special programs to accommodate um, teachers, first responders, or educators. They don't. There is no special program. You know what? I got a special program, and it's the real deal. All you got to do is give me a call at 407-706-3313 or go to my website and apply at webringyouhome.com in your application. Uh, Mention where you heard about me, um, whether it's on my Saturday show or my Sunday show like today. Um, I want to know because it tells me who's listening at different times. Uh, you know that I'm on, uh, the, I also do a real estate and mortgage show on Saturdays with Cleve Loveland at noon. Of course, I appreciate you tuning in to my show today on Sunday. It's a great time to be out thinking about buying or selling real estate. It's a great time if you have uh, procrastinated and you did not refinance and you did not consolidate debt when interest rates are in the twos, and then you're starting to miss the threes. Don't miss the fours and go into the fives, okay? It's going to happen. We're going to see interest rates in the fives. It can't, we can't help it. It's not, it, it's got to happen. I personally, and this sounds crazy, I'm not concerned about it. I'm not concerned about it at all. And I know that even if interest rates went to six or seven and a half percent, which I saw for many years in this industry, running in the sevens. Heck, I got my first house. I was paying nine and a quarter percent on a monthly adjustable. That's an adjustable rate that wasn't fixed for anything other than one month at a time. I'm going to tell you something. It was a great program, but I got it during high interest rates. Don't get fooled by these mortgage companies that are pushing adjustable rates right now. It's a scam. Don't do it. It's not right. Even if you tell me I'm only going to keep the house for three years, don't do it. That's exactly what people said in 2006 and seven. And boy, did they lose their shirt. So don't get caught up on hype. Stick with the solid, the fixed rate. If rates go back down again, we'll refinance you out of it. Don't complain about refinance cost because you. I will t- convince you not to do it if it doesn't give you a break-even period within 36 months. And that's where a lot of folks are getting caught up right now on refinances is they've got these mortgage companies that are quoting them attractive rates but charging them ex- ex- excessive fees. It's ridiculous, you guys. Don't fall for the gimmicks. Go to somebody that you trust. I've been in the business 33 years. I grew up here in Central Florida. I went to Maitland Junior High. I went to Domrick Elementary. I went to Winter Park High School. I struggled and did a few college classes. You know from my story that I'm a 10th grade dropout. That's right. Why would you take financial advice from a 10th grade dropout? Well, I guess you'll just have to come to my class, uh, my real estate mastery class, and learn what I did to accumulate wealth for me and my family. And I will that wealth will be passed on through generations. You want to pass wealth on through generations? You want to become rich and retire with a substantial income from rental properties? Let me show you how to do it. You want to pass those properties on to your children? Let me show you what I'm doing. Because each one of my kids has to contribute five properties to the trust. And if they do that and Chase does it and Paige does it and then their kids do it and their kids do it, what do you think you're creating? You're creating a wealth, a generational wealth that you could have many, many people be able to uh, enjoy the luxuries of having substantial real estate income coming in to you for generations after generations. And if you do it right and you have everyone contribute to purchasing more, what do you think that does for generations to come? I mean, come on, you guys. That's what it's all about. 407-706-3313. I'm the loan arranger. I've been in the mortgage business for 33 years. I've closed over 10,000 transactions, and I want to help you with your next real estate transaction too. Whether it's purchasing or refinancing, call the loan arranger 407-706-3313 or go to my website at webringyouhome.com. Now, if you haven't refinanced yet, it's time to call me. 
it's it, it you're you're gonna you're not gonna like what you see today compared to what you think it was even three months ago. It's getting different. It's gonna get even worse. So don't delay any longer. Let's get something locked in while rates are still attractive. If you are, um, I oh, I, you know what I want to talk about? I want to talk about tax time. So we're in the we're in the season where it's time to get your income tax return. If you're a first time home buyer or want to buy a home, it might be the only time that you've got any cash in your pocket, right? Use that tax dollars to be put a down payment on a house. You don't need to George Foreman grill. You don't need an 80 inch screen Samsung TV. You don't need that stuff. You know what you need? You need a house to bring your children up in because the house is going to make you money. So it's tax time. Use that tax money for a down payment. Call me at 407-706-3313 or go to my website at webringyouhome.com. That's webringyouhome.com. Now, for all of you that like to do your own taxes because it's free, 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 free online, I'm going to tell you something. You get what you pay for. You always get what you pay for. In everything that we do in life, you get what you pay for. So if you're trying to save three, four, five hundred dollars and do your own taxes that probably cost you more than that, then go for it. That's that's your deal. If you're simple W two single, you got a W two, you have no property, you not ha- don't have any expenses to write off, then fine, do your own taxes. But if you want a professional. I've had my taxes done by the same guy for at least 10 years, local right here in Maitland. I'm going to be interviewing Ben Moore with Ben Moore Tax Services in Maitland. And I'm going to be interviewing him about new tax codes next Sunday on the air. So stay tuned to that if you want to know what's going on. Now, if you are self-employed or 1099 or subcontractor, or variable income, and you're getting ready to file your taxes, but you think you may want to buy a house this year, see me first. See me first. Let's analyze previous taxes so that you're not making a mistake. I had two or three clients just this week alone that called me and have already got their taxes prepared to file. And if they would have filed them before I took a look at them, they would not qualify for a mortgage. Now, I'm not telling you how to alter taxes to be able to qualify for mortgage. That's not my goal here. But a lot of you want to write everything off and then wonder why you can't get a mortgage. Sometimes it's better to pay the IRS a little bit more money, show a little bit more money, get what you want. So instead, you want to save $2,000 in taxes to the IRS, but it cost you $100,000 in buying power for a house that would have made you way more than $2,000. So stop doing that, guys. I'm going to tell you, my realtors, the worst at it. Self-employed people, you guys are writing off so much that you'll wonder why you can't get a decent mortgage, and now you're going to continue to rent. So one perpetuates the other problem. Quit doing that. See me, call me, come to my office, visit me. I'll be happy to yell at you about what you're doing with your taxes. But if you want to know from the experts, I'm going to be interviewing Ben Moore from Ben Moore Tax Services next Sunday on the air. So stay tuned for that. If you want his contact information, call me at 407-706-3313. That's 407-706-3313. 3313 or visit my website at webringyouhome.com. That's webringyouhome.com. If you want to text me and say, I need your tax guy, text me, I need your tax guy to 407-706-3313. And my team and I will respond to your text and hook you up with my friend Ben Moore and his team of experts. Now, he's got a lot of folks, CPAs that work for him. So if you are a simple W-2 wage earner or you have just a few deductions, then he puts you with one of his team members that specialize in that. If you are own five businesses and you need, you know, you need auditing and so forth, then he's going to take that on himself or his team of master tax technicians, so to speak, CPAs. So stay tuned to my show next week. I'll be back in five minutes with more of the Lone Arranger radio show, Bruce Woodburn, Cross Country Mortgage. Stay tuned. Call me at 407-706-3313. That's 407-706-3313. Or visit my website and apply for a mortgage at we bring you home. 
WeBringYouHomeHome.com. That's WeBringYouHome.com. Be back in five minutes with more of the Lone Ranger Radio Show. Welcome back to the Lone Ranger Radio Show. My name is Bruce Woodburn, Cross Country Mortgage, and I am the Lone Ranger. This is the last segment of this uh, show on Sunday. I really hope that you found it informative. I had a lot of fun with you today. I hope you're enjoying your Sunday. I know you're on your way home from church. Maybe you're on your way to church. Maybe you're doing chores around the house like I am, uh, working in the yard, um, taking out the garbage, you know, doing all those regular things. My wife is cleaning the house and doing laundry. That's what we do as a family around here. That's what you're doing as a family, and I appreciate you taking time out of your day to listen to my show. I hope you find it is informative and keeps you up to speed on what's going on in the mortgage and real estate industry. Even if you're already a homeowner, you got to keep track of it because it tells you where you're making money. And the great thing about real estate is you're making money and you just had to live somewhere anyway. If you are not a homeowner and you hear this show, or you know somebody that's not a homeowner and you're listening to this show, please have the person call me at 407-706-3313. Houses are going to go up another 20% probably this year. Market slowed, but that's still, I had, I, I can't tell you how many offers I had come across my table that were not accepted by people in this market because there's still multiple offers on a house. Now, Granted, my customers win 70% more often than others. Why? Because I have a special system that helps elevate you so you become the winning offering offer more often when you're negotiating a real estate transaction. If you're interested in knowing more about that, call me at 407-706-3313 or go to my website and apply for a mortgage at webringyouhome.com and tell me you want to get on my fast track full loan approval program. And that way, when my clients are fully approved, I call the seller or the listing agent and I guarantee them that I will close the loan on time on the closing date or I will pay the seller up to $500 per day for every day I miss the closing maxed out at $5,000. How many times do you think I've had to pay that money, guys? Really, think about that. How many times do you think the loan arranger had to pay out $500 a day up to $5,000? Well, the first fact is I've never paid $5,000. The second fact is I did miss a closing and I had to pay that money and I ended up paying two days worth of money. It ended up costing me about $800 and it was because I missed a closing on a USDA transaction that I didn't know had well and septic and it took time to get the well analysis in from the laboratory and I missed that closing. It was I was not informed it was on well and septic but by gosh I ate it, I paid it and that client closed two days later. I don't miss closings, guys. Other lenders have no problem in calling you up and asking for an extension. That is a bad word in my office. You need extension, that means something's happened. Either I failed or the client did not provide me with the information that was requested. That's the trick, guys. Most of the time when people have dissatisfied uh, mortgage transactions, it's because they weren't engaged. Be engaged. I got a client right now I'm working with, and he's like, I just got to make sure I'm closing on time. And I'm like, Val, you got to get me what I ask for when I ask for it. That's the trick. And if you do that, you're always going to close on time with me. If you're a real estate agent, stop screwing around with these turkey lenders out there. They're, they're a bunch of blowhards. I know it because I interview them for jobs all the time. Most of them stink. All right. Call the loan arranger at 407-706-3313. Join my real estate mastery class at 6 p.m. on February 24th. You must go to webringyouhome.com. Visit me at the teacher conference in Jacksonville on the 18th and 19th uh, for the Northeast Winter Leadership Conference. Uh, or call me if you'd like movie tickets. I have got a couple of movie tickets for Uncharted with Mark Wahlberg and Tom Holland. 
This has been the Lone Ranger Radio Show with Bruce Woodburn. I hope you've enjoyed this beautiful Sunday. God bless every one of you. Thank you for spending time with me this afternoon. And don't forget to call me at 407-706-3313. You can text that number as well. Or go to my website and apply for a new mortgage, refinance, or purchase at webringyouhome.com. That's webringyouhome.com. God bless and have a great weekend.